What's going on, everybody here? Welcome back to some more Hydroneer. Last episode, we got our mine up and running, and today we're going to improve it. We're going to clean it up. We're going to add some more machines and just have a good time. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all fun things. So, first of all, we need to get this bar in here with that one. And I need to get iron. Okay, so now how much iron do we have here? 1467 heck yes we're gonna go take this up and uh, we're gonna turn it into a couple of machines and then get those hooked into the system and then we're gonna do some cleaning up i want to go get some of the the fancy looking stuff next door across the uh, across the way um kind of get some flooring and stuff like that in there get some things organized up a little bit we're not gonna like complete it today and then i also want to go look at some logistics stuff because i'd like to get my um i went the wrong way I'd like to get the uh, the filters auto repairing, so that way we don't really have to worry about them. Um, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, that's what we're doing today. So let's go ahead and let's start off first with this. Now I should be able to put all of this in here because it gives me the extra back out of it, anyways. And there goes that one. And then it's gonna give me a bar. And then I can run this bar up here. And actually, you know what? I'm going to combine all of the bars that I have here. Because I believe it only takes what it needs. So now we should be able to make another one. I think we can make four, if I'm not mistaken. We might be able to make a little bit more, depending on how much was already here. There's another little bar in there. Oh, isn't he adorable? Oh, he's so cute. Little tiny bar of iron. And there goes another one. And then let's see. I think we should be able to make at least one more here. Okay, so I'm only going to make that one more right now. I'm going to leave the other bar just chilling here. and We'll come back and do the things as we need to. I don't want to put it in there because I don't think it's going to be enough. Um, do any of these, any of this stuff go down? This goes, that goes up to the truck. I don't want to go up to the truck. I want to go, you know what? Let's just drop it down here. Yeah, that works. <laughs> that works. We'll just do that. All right. So all of those are down there. Oop. Okay. Guess we're going down here too. It doesn't really matter. Ow. Let's go ahead and get these set up. I don't think we don't have the piping for them yet, but that's okay. We'll get the piping for them. Oh, this is going to be good. We are literally doubling our output right now. Oh, it's going to be so nice. You know, I got to say, this is, this is absolutely beautiful. It's been so long since we had a beautiful mine like this. Like, oh, it's been a while. Long time in the making, but it's finally happening. Uh, all right, so I need some T-pipes here. Let me see if I can find all my T-pipes. Might not have any more T-pipe. Oh, there's a T-pipe. I need two. Oh, we got plenty. Plenty of pipes. All right, they're all hooked up. Whoa. What? going on here okay I think we need to get the shovel I don't think they have enough dirt down there so let me go grab the shovel I think that's what's going on I think they're like hitting rock hitting the bottom so we're gonna go over here we're gonna have to use this guy and bring up the level just a little bit I think that's what's going on So there's that one, maybe. It's kind of hard to do this, I'm not going to lie. I think it's like right here. Hmm. Okay, I think that'll work. Let's go ahead and see. No.
Interesting. Those two won't work right here. I wonder why that is. See, I don't see anything different than what we're doing anywhere else. Everything is full of dirt. But it sounds like it's bottoming out, which is super weird. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to grab one of these machines. I'm going to throw it over here. Nope. Same thing. Huh. Well, that's kind of a bummer. Not exactly sure what's going on here. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what's going on there. So, I mean, I guess the only, like, the next option is to start putting them out here. Oh, darn it. And I guess they just can't go back that far? I don't, I don't know. Because that's only, what, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's only six. How come I can't, why? It might, maybe, it's just, gotta, it's got to be something with, like, maybe the terrain right here. Or maybe it's just, like, too shallow for him. Or something. That's kind of weird, though. Because, like, it, it goes all the way down to the floor here. It's like, there's that much soil above it. Huh. Well, I mean, that's okay. Because guess what? Now we're going to have to figure out this whole system. I uh, got to get another booster on here, which we actually have another booster. So, hey, you know what? We had to set it up anyways. So let's just go ahead and do it now. Okay, so this one should be fairly easy to get fixed up here. Basically, that's going to go there. This is going to go there. And then we need a straight pipe there. And system number two is already online. Easy enough. And ta-da. Should work now, right? Hey, it's working. All right, cool. Um, let's see. I am. Is there a T pipe back here? Heck, yes, there is. Put that on there. That one's going. Let's go ahead and get a cork for that bad boy. Do I have another cork over here? <gasps> I do indeed. I wasn't expecting to have to work on the second row for a while, so I mean, huh, what a change. Change of plans that one was. All right, cool. Fantastic. All right, so that's going. That's doing this thing. Uh, but like I said, I want to get a little bit of this stuff organized in here. So I want to run up and I want to get some more of these floors here. Oh, I don't think I brought any money with me. How much is this gold bar worth? Nine. Th oh, that's Cloudium. That's why. Uh, we're not touching the Cloudium because we're going to need that. How much is this gold bar worth? 3,200. Holy moly. Let's throw that in here. Uh, this is this is going nicely. Oh my gosh. Look at all the resources going in here. Uh-oh. Having a little bit of an issue here. So this is what else. Oh, shoot. Actually... Is it that one? Oh yeah, it was that one. Okay. So that was the issue I was talking about. Like sometimes when you get so far away, some of these things will get stuck up on those lips like that. Uh, and that's what I'm always looking out for. But this one seems to be doing okay. Good gosh. Oh my gosh. Things are falling. There's cloudy right there. Holy moly. This is amazing. There's another cloudy. Okay. Uh, yeah, I need to go make some money so we can get some of the stuff going. I need to figure out where I can sell though. I know there was a, a gem thing right outside. Maybe I can maybe I can sell gold there. Too. I probably can't. That's the problem. Hmm. You know what? We'll sell our gems out there. That's fine. How much are you worth? Seventeen forty-five. It's like look at this. This is why it doesn't even want to go anywhere. Yeah, you know what? We'll just sell all of the gems. It's fine. We'll throw them on this bucket. We'll take them outside. We will sell them on the stock market, and then we will buy some new parts and pieces. All right, stock market. Don't do me dare. Oh, it looks like it's raised. 111%? 
81 43 i will take it thank you uh, let's go and throw this back down into the mine oh i guess i could have threw the thing to bring it into the truck up here mm, darn i didn't even think about that all right let's get some of these pieces in here and let's start getting our place looking a little bit nicer so i definitely want some floors how much are these floors 30 a pop that's not bad Grab those. We'll throw those down. All right. So that stuff, I bought some of the stuff. I'm, I'm sure we're going to need more. I'm going to go ahead and throw my money down here in case we need anything from the other shop. And let's get ourselves back down in there and let's see if we can't start organizing some things up and clean some things up, making things look a little, a little nicer. All right. So first off, I want to see if this floor is going to fix That is upside down. I want to see if this floor is going to fix the floor under here so we can actually place stuff. Ooh, it looks like it is. Okay, good. Okay, so it does in fact look like that is going to work. So those should be able to go there. And then I also want to grab, not that, these walls. And tuck those back in there. Why won't you go right here? So it'll go there. But it won't go right next to it. Oh, you know what? Might be the tool rack. No. I, see, this is the part that confuses me. It's like, mm, I mean, maybe it could be up here. Yeah, that's what it was. Okay. Got it. Um, and then these, um, these were actually going to go on the outside. Of course, it's not going to work right there. Why would it? Why would it work right there? These are going to go on the outside along with these walls like this. And it's going to make it look like it's kind of like a house built into the side of the wall here because like, why not? Like, how cool is that? Oh, darn it. That was the wrong button. You walk in a nice little house, all that fun stuff. Uh, this door is going to go over here. Oh, we already got some filters breaking. Let's we'll set these over there for now. But then you can kind of see like, oh, yeah, it looks like a fancy little place. I like it. I like it. Okay. Uh, can we get one in here? Can't get it right there, though, of course. Yeah, I like that. See, this is going to look this is going to look so much nicer than just have everything laying out. You know, we can have this. Um, I'll probably end up clearing this. We'll probably put up like a ceiling and stuff like that, too. Uh Everything stopped because that thing broke. And then there's also these little half walls, which I was thinking about maybe doing something like this. Actually, no, yeah, something like that. And then maybe putting like stuff back in here. I don't know. Kind of just play with it. Um, let's get this fixed though. And everything's back up and running. Okie dokie. Yeah, so I need to get some more floors in here. But I do. I, I like where this is going. Now, uh, future, future things, what would be cool is if I actually cleared out higher than this and made this like a two-story and had a whole upstairs. I think that would be really cool. But oh, I, don't, I really don't want to work on clearing all that dirt again. Clearing that dirt was so much... So much of a pain. It was so much of a pain. Okay, so I need what? Six more floors. One, two, three, four, five, six more floors to get this side done with the flooring. Uh, and then we can start moving some things actually like around here a little bit. Yeah, let me go grab let me go grab the six more floors. Um grab this. This goes to the surface, right? Yes. 
I wish I could just ride with it. Let me go. Take me. And since we're up here, we're going to go look at the logic stuff right now. Um, I need to see what we need in order to get our logic circuit set up for our filters. So let's go ahead and let's hop in the truck. I have 7,500 coin. I don't know if that's going to be enough. I know the logic stuff is like pretty pricey, but we're going to go see what we need. I have an idea and I think, I think we'll be able to tell. I think we'll be able to get this fixed. Okay, so we've got logic spanner hurling unit. When any logic value bigger than zero is entered, hurl spanner forward can be refilled by spanners or tool bags. Stores 20. Logic durability reader passes a durability reading every second if facing an item which has durability. Logic weight reader passes an accumulative weight reading when a resource enters in front and can be reset using the top input oh and then this has a logic count a weight reader interesting that's new logic compressor logic smelter advanced smelting technology requires logic input to create a bar takes damage logic destroyer destroys items when switched on leaves no trace of the item magnet reader display a light hook produces light color can oh so you just put that on wiring logic delay one second logic delay 10 seconds uh flip diode validator a flip-flop logic valve we got our wiring here inputs repeater button lever greater than okay so i think what we need is i think we need Holy moly, these are expensive. The spanner hurler, logic durability, and I'm pretty sure we literally just loop those together. I think we go 90, 90, and okay, so hold on. If the pipe is right here, this would actually have to be like this facing down, or yeah, we'll have it like that. So it would read from here. So we would need a 90, a straight, a 90, a straight, and a 90. Three 90s and two straights. That, I think... Is that right? Like one... Two... And then three... And then a space in between... I think I think that's what we need uh, but that's like 2,000 set up plus we also have to get the spanners in there and we need to do this basically times five so about 10,000 for everything let's oh let's make let's get let's buy this and let's make sure that this is going to work first before we do anything else All right, let's see if we can't get this thing figured out. I think we know what we're doing here. Actually, you know what? I'm going to replace this. I'm going to replace this third one right here. Um, Like that. But I want the number out. Yes. Okay, so I think that's going to hook like that. And then I think this... Is gonna hook like like that. So I think it's gonna read like that, and then we can hook that up via connections. I think. I don't know if it's that simple, but we're gonna find out here. Okay, so let's put this on here and let's see how this is gonna work. If this even is going to work. So let's fix this. How do I add this? Uh. Oh shoot. Okay, that that did not that did not work. Uh. That that did not work. 
That sucked up all of my stuff. Hmm. Maybe this has to be on the top? You know what? I bet we need a... I bet you it needs to be a flip-flop. Instead of it sending a signal every time, because basically it was going, hey, send a signal, send a signal. We need to realize something different and recognize a different signal. Uh, yeah, I think that's what we need. Okay, I'm going to head back. <laughs> Uh, I think I think we got to get the one figured out before we get any other ones figured out Okay, so I picked up the flip hook the logic flip hook turns the incoming logic of zero into one and anything bigger or equal to one into zero I Don't know if this is the right one But like out of all of them this one sounded the most right <laughs> So I'm gonna try this one uh, So basically what I'm hoping is it's flipping the signal uh, that's really what I want. I want because it, it's constantly reading this is like boop signal boop signal I want it to be where this normal phase doesn't get sent and when anything changes it gets sent You know what I'm saying? So I'm hoping That's what's gonna happen here. Um, but in order to do that, I'm gonna need some money um, Darn it. I need to oh, I don't have any wrench. No, I don't no, I have no money anywhere Oh, and I, I don't think I can sell this. I don't want to sell the cloudium though. Uh, I left all my money back at the other store. I'll just go get it. Well, maybe I left some here. I don't know. Let me check. Did I leave any money in here? Oh, <gasps> I did. Oh, I left a good amount of money. Okay. I'm going to buy one of those. Grab that. Okay, let's go. I'm going to see if this works. Because if this doesn't work, it's going to use all my wrenches again. <laughs> it's just not fun. Okay, so first thing I want to do is I want to go ahead and do that. Oh! Okay, there's four wrenches in there. There's four wrenches in there. And they're staying in there! The only way I'll know this works is when that one breaks. Which, I mean, this one broke and then this one broke. Oh, you know what though? It did just throw a bunch of wrenches at this one before yeah it did just throw a bunch of wrenches at that one before so we need about we need about 8,000 coin in order to repeat this process for all of them so basically we have one here 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 and then we can throw wrenches on any of these and then they should they should, in theory, fix these automatically. So as soon as that breaks, boop, sends a signal, and what by him fixes it with a wrench, and it should be good. Will it be good? I have no idea, but it should be. <laughs> oh, the marvels of Hydrogen. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's see what we've got. Man, I can't believe I don't have anywhere else to sell right now. So like. I'm kind of just waiting. I think we're just gonna wait it out a little bit. Let let uh, let some stuff get collected, and then we're gonna take a trip and sell everything, and then hope for the best. Um, but yeah, awesome. Okay, so we've got some logic coming in here. That's gonna be good. We've got a rough design on the building. Oh, we got our foundations placed. Let's go. Let's get these in here. What in the heck? Let's get these all placed. So that way we have a nice, beautiful floor. Oh my gosh, look at that. That really just livens up the place. And then once we put all the walls in, um, I'm going to have to get these higher, though. We're going to have to raise this up again. I want to get a second floor in here. Um, even if it's just like a little balcony thing, I think it'd be kind of cool. But the majority of our work right here is kind of like... I don't want to say the majority of the work is done, but the majority of the work I feel like it's done. Because ultimately, from here on out, it's going to be a matter of not even really messing with the conveyors and stuff anymore. It's going to be upgrading our drills upgrading the harvester and then possibly upgrading the pipes um for all of these and in order to upgrade all these pipes we're gonna need like i'm gonna say before we upgrade any pipes we're gonna need 500,000 hydro coins because i don't want to tear a part of it or like half of it apart you know i want to like tear one off replace the pipe put it back boom 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 it's gonna be a really slow process but it, it'll work and then um yeah basically we're gonna sit here kind of let these machines do their thing 
hopefully get another four machines in here and then i mean we could even get into the secondary line running right here but i feel like the rate that we're getting ore right now is it's pretty good I feel like it's pretty good i don't know, leave a comment down below let me know what you think and like i said i think this should work but really the only way i can tell is like just to let it run so i'm gonna assume that it works and i'm gonna assume that we need to go ahead and build all of them and that we should be good <laughs> so um yes yeah, thank you so much for coming out have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day next episode uh like i said i think we're going to finish the logistics we'll hopefully get those done um we're going to get all of our stuff sorted and we're gonna make a trip to town sell everything make a bunch of money get the logistics done and then get some more um i'm not gonna dig this out right now that's what i need to do next to finish this up but i'm not doing it i don't want to do that right now it's just it was not fun. I didn't have a good time doing that. Um, but yeah, have a good have a good day. I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.